hi guys and welcome back to my channel if you could like comment subscribe click the little notification bell and let's get on to your reading virgo okay as usual this is sun moon rising for virgo we're going to clarify with your finger keeper uh finger sequel keeper deck here both decks have been shuffled beforehand so just a light shuffle on the screen and let's get into your reading virgo Okay, so this is a timeless love reading for Virgo. So when you see this reading will be the right time. And we've got the Knight of Wands. Chariot. Justice. Six of Cups. Okay. Ten of Pentacles, the Emperor, Page of Wands, and the Seven of Cups. And the bottom of the deck we have the Queen of Swords here. Okay. Right, Virgo, let's get into your reading. So with the Knight of Wands, um, it's a very passionate person that's um, coming into your life. Um, and they're moving with great speed because we've got the chariot here after the Knight of Wands. Now, Knight of Wands is a very passionate, fast-moving knight anyway. But they're coming in to bring balance into your life and i have a feeling it could be someone you already know or a past connection because we've got here the six of cups which is happy memories fond memories from the past of this person so this could be that it's somebody that you've separated with maybe or you've had time apart and it looks like they're coming back into your life and like I said, it will bring balance into your life. And there's nice memories. You know, it could even be a, a, a past connection like a friend. But they're coming back in and you're looking back on past memories. And you could have even grown up with this person. You know, they could be a childhood friend. But you have known this person for a, quite a long time. Virgo. It could even be... You know, someone you fell in love with a long time ago, even far back as, as you know when you you were at school with this person, maybe. But I think you grew up together. Um, whoever it is, you've got you've got some kind of past with this person, um, and they're now coming back into your life. Now this person here, it's interesting because if you see here we've got the Six of Cups and we've got where the boy is growing up with the dog but then after that on the second row here we've got the Ten of Pentacles and there's the very same guy with that dog again but now there's a, a family around him and he's sharing that dog with the happy family here. So I think what's happening is you're going to reconnect with this person and it could lead to it could lead to marriage because we have the Ten of Pentacles, which is family wealth being handed down and the you know success of a of a happy financial commitment there with somebody. Now this person could be quite stubborn. And he could be quite stubborn in the past, maybe. This is the Emperor here. And then we've got the Page of Wands. Which is news coming in. And you've got a decision to make, Virgo. Because with that news coming in from this Emperor, you've got a, de you've got a decision 
you've got a decision there with the Seven of Cups. And you're thinking about it because at the bottom of the deck, if you remember, we had the Queen of Cups. Sorry, the Queen of Swords. So you are trying to clarify in your mind what to do about this new person or the person that you knew from the past and this new offer that's come in. They're very passionate about you. Here we can see they're all fired up in their head. The Ace of Wands, that was also on the bottom of the deck. And again, the Knight of Wands, they're very passionate about you. So let's get some clarification on some of these cards, Virgo. Let's clarify the Six of Cups. Yeah, this is somebody from your from your past, from your community. You've known this person. They could be a family friend. You definitely, definitely know this, this person and the connection there. Let's clarify the Emperor. Privileged lady again. Yeah, they could have gone off with somebody else or... Or this emperor is married and maybe they didn't see you before in that way. Maybe their marriage is going wrong. Maybe they're single now. But they're coming towards you with the privileged lady. Let's have another clarification on that card. Hmm. Yeah, you're concerned here because it it looks like that maybe they want to do they want to keep you as the privileged lady or they want to maybe have an affair with you well they're still connected to somebody else and maybe they're coming in with this offer and this is what's leading you to think is this right you know maybe they're going to come towards you telling you about their connection that they're in and that it's not working for them and they want to get things back on track with you. The Emperor's definitely got a connection already here. Let's clarify the Knight of Wands. Despair. Yeah, they're not they're they're gonna come into your life. They're coming back into your life and then then they're definitely not happy. They're not happy with the decisions that they've made in the past with, with regards to what's going on with their connection that they're in at the moment. They're not happy. And they're coming back in. They're moving towards you. Let's clarify the Justice card. Yeah, they're coming in with a message. They, they're definitely going to be contacting you. You're going to hear something. I think what's happening is you're going to hear from someone that maybe you used to date or you had a connection with. They got married to somebody else or they went to live with somebody else, went off in their own direction. And it hasn't worked out for them, basically. And they're coming back to you wanting to be with you and now you're having to make a decision on that let's clarify the seven of cups main mail yeah this person wants to be the main person in your life they want to be your lover here let's get another clarification on the main mail the two wanted to come out here. Yep, they're at, they're at a distance, so they could be abroad. And they want a new start with you. They want a new life with you because they're 
the pathway opens up to a brand new start with somebody else. They could have been they could even be moving away from you know splitting up from somebody. They might even come back and tell you that their message of concern they've got divorced recently. Um you know, but they haven't had a very good time of it. And they want to make they want to reconnect with you basically. They want to reconnect with you. Or they've made the decision, or they're thinking of making the decision to be with you. Which means they've got to move. They could even come, you know, and see you from abroad. And it could be that you are the privileged lady or the third party in this relationship. And they're deciding maybe to leave the person that they're with to be with you. Okay, I'm going to leave it there, Virgo. I hope you've enjoyed your reading. Please, as I said, if you could comment, like, subscribe, click the little notification bells. I do do these readings sporadically at the moment. Um, and always believe in yourself. Follow your dreams. Stay blessed, guys.